but I'm preparing for this TOEFL exam but I'm confused there are so many resources which one should I choose and honestly speaking I don't even have resources can you help me with a few resources it's I'm just clueless right now hmm TOEFL accepted by 12,000 institutions and 160 countries hmm nice choice you're at the right place bro that i know already that's why i'm giving toefl but could you also provide some basics on learning english right now for anyone like i have to get a good score in toefl okay this is something you need to know learning english and getting a high score on toefl requires four skills first one would be listening second speaking third reading and fourth writing now as far as toefl is concerned in speaking section you need to express your ideas clearly and coherently in terms of the listening section, you need to comprehend spoken content effectively. That means if I'm saying something, you need to understand all of that. In terms of the reading section, you'll have to analyze the text that is written. So if I've given you a prompt, you'll have to understand what is written here. And in terms of writing, you just have to express your ideas in terms of an essay. So you'll have to write something. Wait, I'm getting confused. So I am not good with my English. So I'll have to start with basics. Where do I start if I have to start from absolute basics? absolutely it's essential to build a strong foundation so let's suppose you're starting from absolute basics then there are two websites i'm highly recommending you one is babel and the other one is khan academy these two websites just to make yourself ready with basic english that's just the basic component then we move ahead okay noted thanks for that recommendation but now if i have to start preparing just for TOEFL, now let's suppose i'm done with my basics i do understand basic english now if i have to start what do you recommend in terms of preparation? How long should I prepare for it? Okay, duration. Um, I would say keep it one or two months after you're done with your basics part. But remember one thing, it depends all on how much time you're dedicating and your consistent practice and regular assessments. Got it. Consistency is the key for sure. But can you provide me with some specific resources for improving all these four skills in general? I mean, you talked about these four skills. But do you have some resources for it? Okay, I'll tell you what are all the best resources that I've found. So for speaking section, I would either use Italki or Tandem and also get some sample questions from ETS website. That could be a great help with my speaking section. Apart from that, if I'm a very bad speaker, I would also start recording myself in front of the videos. Murad Beg is a bad speaker. I was a terrible speaker, but now I make videos. So yes, videos help you. Recording yourself helps you. The next section is the writing section. In this, you need to analyze essays. So for this, I would use resources like Beat the Test. Amazing. I would also use the new writings for an academic discussion. These are all free practice sets and the link is this one. Next for reading, I will in general try to improve my reading by reading more and more novels. But if you want TOEFL specific reading resources, then I would go to the TOEFL Go app. I would also go to Prep Scholar 327 vocab words and New York Times. Apart from that, Quizlet can also be a good improvement. And fourth is listening. And in order to improve my listening, I would start listening to more and more English dialogues. For that, I would start watching TV series. If I have to watch a TV series, I would highly recommend Suits or Billions. I personally love both of these. But other than that, if you want TOEFL specific podcasts, then you could watch TOEFL TV, TOEFL Talks and site like Ello. Bro, you're a lifesaver. I mean... I genuinely want to thank you and for that I would hit the like button because I know you are making all this content it requires a lot of work so I'll at least hit the like button for you but uh, right now can you tell me a bit more about these more free resources specific to TOEFL I mean are there any other free resources just specific to TOEFL yeah sure why not let's start with the free resource list Wait, you have more free resources. Yeah, please. Can't wait now. Please, please, please. Okay, to begin with, I would start with the E2 resources. Now, e2language.com, they use content directly from the ETS. And here you will get practice full link tests as shown on their YouTube channel. Bro, you're my lifesaver. What else would a person want? I mean, I'm studying for TOEFL. I have all the free resources. Well, um, okay, let me help you with one more resource. There is a website called English Club, which is 
for free as well. It is a site that provides free resources for both English learners as well as the teachers. This site has particularly helpful information regarding the TOEFL test and contains 20 helpful tips regarding the TOEFL exam. These 20 I would highly recommend you to check out. Bro, this all sounds perfect. I hate to be doing this, but do you have any other resource I should know about? Well, uh, there's a lot of resource you need to know. Uh, have you checked out Magush? I would say it's really insightful. So Magush is more like a treasure chest full of great resources. So they have the best guide to the TOEFL IBT. It's an ebook that dwells deep into each section of TOEFL. And if you're looking for something complex to work with, I would recommend you to check this out. Dude, this Magush sounds good. Do they also have like different section tests? So practice tests were different. Uh, I would recommend you to check out this link by Magush. It has the best free TOEFL resources, all of them at one place. So this can be helpful to you. So you're recommending me to go ahead with Magush. I'll do that. Wait, do you have any other resource? If not Magush, anything else? Hmm, more. Uh, in that case, bro, have you checked out the ETS website? It is like a gold mine of practice tests. ETS TOEFL Go app also, I mean, these, this is the link. So the best thing with ETS is they have this TOEFL Go app, which you can use on your desktop, laptop, and mobile. ETS being the organization that actually administers TOEFL, bro, it offers official mock tests for reading, speaking, listening, and writing sections. And with internal access, you can open and test all your mock tests anytime. This is the ETS link. Whoa, bro, that's impressive. Do you have any other test resources maybe okay so you can use the testguide.com i mean they have the free practice tests you can use those and they can help you improve your scores eventually at this point i just feel like i should merge all these free resources that you gave but it just seems like a lot wait no way do you have like one comprehensive thing that has like all of the TOEFL syllabus together Okay, so one website where you will get all these things together in one place would be the mygreatlearning.com. So they have an entire blog written on this. I would recommend you the link of that. That is here. So this is a comprehensive place which covers all your sections like listening, speaking and also assesses your spoken content and written content as well. So I would recommend you this because it is like a comprehensive thing. So you get everything into one place. This is dope. This is precisely what I was looking for. Thank you so much, bro. I mean, I think I have all the resources, but is there any YouTube channel that you recommend? Bro, there is this person called Asil Islam Hanova. I don't know how to pronounce his name, but he has like this entire playlist on TOEFL, which would be really good for you. So I would recommend you to check out this link. And I've already left this link in the description. You can check that out as well. Okay, bro. I'm now just ready with my TOEFL exam preparation. Thank you so much. I'll start my preparation, give my TOEFL exam and send you my score. You deserve to know. I mean, if I'm not DMing Murad my TOEFL score, even after listening to all these resources, I'm such a bad person. I'll do that. Thank you so much, bro. But hate to do that to you. I have one more question before you get mad at me i just wanted to know if there is any unique resource that can help me improve my score because i didn't tell you this i did give my toefl exam in the past i didn't score well can i improve my score okay so if you want to elevate your score in that case i would recommend you the linguatrip.com so they've got like a phrasal verb pdf that actually helps a lot of students that's interesting, but wouldn't this lingua trip increase my expense of giving the TOEFL exam? I already don't have a lot of money. No, not at all, bro. So the TOEFL IBT fee remains the same, making it a reasonable investment considering it is something that is accepted worldwide. Okay, let me tell you something that not a lot of people know. So you can go and tell this to everyone because it might help them also. So when you're registering for the TOEFL exam, you can get a $20 discount. Yes, $20 discount. Oh, wait, how do you get this discount? So when you're registering, just use the code MURR20 on the official TOEFL IBT test. And yeah, your brother Murad will give you $20 discount from my end at the official TOEFL exam. And just so you know, the TOEFL test is just now for two hours. What the?
you have a coupon code with the actual TOEFL Institute MURR20 and I use that code and I <sighs> wow and last question do you have any full length practice tests okay yeah yeah we need to talk about the full length practice tests they are very essential for your test taking ability because if you're not taking these tests it would hinder your progress so for that the first thing that i would recommend is the ets which offers the official practice tests on their website which is a very close mirror to the actual TOEFL exam that you're going to give also there is one more by manhattan review so this is the ets link this is the manhattan review link try both these out Okay, so you have told me practice tests, you have told me where to take my resources from, you have given me everything. Uh, you have not given me prep books for TOEFL. If you, if you just know of any, I mean, just tell me any. So for books, test prep books, first thing that I would definitely, everyone would recommend you is the official guide to the TOEFL test. That's, that's by the institute, so you have to use it, by ETS. Second would be the Barron's TOEFL IBT that is by Pamela Sharp. So that also helps a lot. And third one would be Cracking TOEFL IBT and Kaplan TOEFL IBT Premier. So all these four I would recommend in the same order. Awesome, bro. So remember to be consistent with your practice and dedication. That's going to be the key. It's not a difficult exam. Even Murad has given it. It's not that difficult. But yeah, don't forget to check out the TOEFL official guide setup, 6th edition. This link, it's also in the description. I didn't even ask for that last resource. You just wanted to help students. I see the dedication. Thank you so much. I'm giving my TOEFL exam. And since I'm giving my TOEFL exam, I would recommend students to watch this video also. Yeah, bro, best of luck. And yes, this video. Oh my God, you recommend. See, I helped you. You helped me ask students to watch this video for... We're brothers and best of luck for TOEFL, MURR20.